this pantry, I can understand why some of the really healthy habits aren't coming through. The shelves seem to be super functional, they're really high off the Hey, can you sit on here? All right, you guys, we are at the dentist. This is actually the first time I've been out of the house and the camera has done those line things somewhere. What is that thing? What? So Bryson and Ethan have appointments today. King's appointment is on Monday and he's very sad about it. Huh. You better quit with the tickle bugs, Tom. They're coming. They're coming. Tickle bugs. Vitamins to make them nice and healthy and strong. Me too. I just had vitamins yesterday. Yeah? I uh, but yeah, let's, uh. <laughs> and then just give that about 25 to 30 minutes before they raise. Yep. Alright, okay, you guys, we are officially finished with the dentist. It is currently 10 up 10 up 3. I'm just gonna go ahead and head straight over to the library for story time and we'll actually be there on time for once and be able to grab some seats. I was going to stop at the house, but I think I'm just going to go ahead and head straight over there. I might stop and get me a snack or something like that because I have not eaten and I was hungry when I woke up, so we'll see. I know my favorite breakfast burrito spot is on the is right by their dentist office, but I, look at that nail. That, this nail popped off last night when I was cooking dinner. That's annoying. But yeah, we're about to head to the library library good job thank you <laughs> all right you guys so i passed by my little favorite it's called texas burrito here where i live so if you're in the lubbock area texas burrito on 50th and i want to say it's like avenue w on 50th and avenue w in lubbock texas burrito has the best burritos but there's always a line so I came up to Sonic. It's a little bit closer to the library. So as soon as we we're five minutes away from the library, so as soon as we leave Sonic, we'll head to the library. And yes, I'm gonna go in here with my Sonic, unless the sign says not to take food like that. But I haven't eaten. I just got the bur the boys a little plain and dry cheeseburger. Use the Sonic app, and then I got a Route 44 water, and I decided to add peach and mango flavoring. And I'm hoping that it's good. Like, if you are ever craving soda, always get water and add flavor to it. I'm trying to get back on my water game because if you can see, when I got my birth control taken out, I'm starting to break out. So I got to be very careful with my gut health right now. Got to be careful with my water intake. So that is what we're doing. I did order me, a, I still ordered me a breakfast burrito and some French toast sticks and then yeah, but mm, 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 I'm excited. Um, oh my cup. But um, yeah. So we're at here. Is Sonic waiting. I always use the app because anytime you use the app, it's always happy hour. So just here waiting on our food. I'll see you guys once we get to the library. I'm starting to become a lot, a lot more comfortable with vlogging everywhere. So I'm excited about that too. Oh, I want to fix that nail and I didn't pick it up last night because I was just going to glue it back on but I was like you know what and I told myself just because one pops off I'm not popping off all of them because I really need to stop damaging my nails so yeah I'll see you guys once we get to the library but that is bothering me that that is bothering me but you can also tell on the other ones they're getting oh, let's see. You can tell on the other ones that it's starting to, um, like, they're starting to be ready to pop off. Like, you can tell. But, yeah. So. Y'all remind me. Stop popping my nails off. All right. See y'all at the library. You needed your hat for the video, Ethan? I want I'll take the I need it. Mommy, Brad, you stole my hat. 
guys think of a bat, please. Sonic. Here for story time. Lots of people here today. So I see you guys want to leave here. And we go back. Actually have... It is actually soccer. Oh, everybody get one. Tell us, say, I play soccer. I play soccer. I play soccer. <laughs> Look, listen, he's telling me. Where did he get that? <laughs> They have a soccer, our local soccer team here today reading to them. They got their mascot here. The boys are so excited. I said perfect day to come since they are super into soccer right now. You can drink some when you come back. Good morning. Ethan. My boys are right here. They're trying to get closer and closer to the matador sitting right there. So, I'm going to ask you, are you ready to play some soccer with us? Okay, so we can all go outside and play some soccer together. <laughs> Bryson, you have to share. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. All right, you guys, we are finally back home. I put my hair up. The boys were, I think I inserted some clips. I believe I did. Um, after the Story time, the team ended up taking all the kids outside. They were playing like some soccer games, doing like some little soccer drills. So they did that for about 30 minutes. But we're home now because King's speech therapist is coming here in a minute. We're getting some chores done. Um, I need to put my hair up because anytime I'm outside, I feel like when I get home, it's, you just got to put the hair up. Like it's just like, it's a law at this point. So yeah, I'm about to stretch my back rest and then I'm going to edit this video finally get that up today and then go ahead and start editing the video for Friday so well tomorrow so I'll see you guys later speech therapy is done the boys' lunch is in the oven. I have three minutes left, so we're going to see if I can do this next task within those three minutes. I still haven't started editing. I've been laying there on my phone for the last hour. But I promise after this last task, I'm going to start editing. So for the last, for about a week, those have been thumbtacked up there because the things kept falling. But we have, there we go, we have command strips now. So now those no longer need to be thumb tacked up there. So I'm going to fix the little hooks, replace the little command strip, and get them put up. So, yeah. Y'all, well, we tried taping these and everything. <laughs> they did not want to stay up there. So it says that one of these is good for three pounds. 
I can't imagine that that curtain in the rod weighs more than six. But I think I'll double up just in case. Just in case we'll double up. Alright y'all, that was not the end of it. Once I stopped recording, the freaking curtain fell down. That freaking curtain fell down. So if you can see that little speck, I thumbtack it right there. That's where I'm at with them curtains. And I also forgot, I need to take Ethan's glasses to get fixed. Forgot that those broke a couple of days. I need to go get some melatonin. So while they're eating, I'm going to edit. But as soon as I finish eating... We're going to run to go drop Ethan's glasses off real quick. Hopefully they can do it where they just pop the lenses in and out. I'm hoping. So here's to hoping that they have his glasses frame in stock. Oh, and then we're, we're coming up on a year too. two. Oh, we're coming up on a year. So his warranty might be expiring soon. I'm frustrated. I'm tired. I'm going to edit until they're done eating. And then we're going to head to the store and drop off his glasses. Because they haven't been wanting to take a nap. So guess what I'm going to go get? Melatonin. Banger. Anyways, y'all, we finally made it at the house. It is 2:25, so we got literally 30 minutes to get everything done. We're at the glasses place now. Then we're gonna head to go get some melatonin. I think I'm gonna check out this natural grocery store. That's a little bit like just down the street that way. And if they don't have it, then I'll turn back around and go to Walmart. But it's not too much out of the way at all. So right now we're heading to go drop these glasses off. Let's go take these in here. And boy, do I hope that his, I really hope his warranty has not expired yet. There's a whole line. Oh my god. Alright, so once one of these people move, I'm next. Didn't take too long. So I believe that this happened to Ethan's glasses when he got hit in the face with the soccer ball. So here's to hoping they can fit they can just get a pair from over there and then just pop these lens out and pop like pop them into a new frame. That's usually what they do. In here, like I said, that's what I'm hopeful for. Usually, when I bring them, they just um, pop the lenses out of this frame and put, put them in a new frame. I want to say we didn't come till after June last year, so hopefully, these are still good because the warranty is for a year typically. Because every year you need to update your prescription, which also I'm going to need to tell his dad about that so that way his dad can pay for his next visit. So, I'm going to tell him now, hey, next month, either needs, a, needs uh, his eye exam. So given my good enough time. Right, so far, so good. Glasses are still under one. Just the They're getting your face. Just a frame today. Okay. So I think you, with his lens, yeah, you guys usually have to reorder them, yeah. So if you want to order them, I don't mind. 
Because he has something to do with his stigmatism, so you guys have to order them. All right, it only took 10 minutes. Um, we replaced the frames today, and then she ordered new lenses for Ethan because he has a stigmatism in each eye. So they always have to special order his lenses. Poor baby. But, um, all right, we are about to head out y'all so here we go now to natural glaciers right, you guys we are here literally like a 30 second drive i see so many good things about this popcorn y'all want to get one they're on sale for 2.99 maybe we can have a movie day tomorrow y'all want um, sweet and salty or cheese that's just salt. See? Ew. Ew. <laughs> I have avocado. Ooh, I don't like avocado. We'll get no cheese cheesiness. And that can be our snack for our movie day. Oh, oh look, I got all the cereal here. It's just expensive. I got a Mommy, do you want applesauce? Applesauce? We have applesauce at home, don't we? Oh, look, this is exactly what I need right here. I need these teas. Cinnamon flavor. Can we get this? What I'm specifically looking for is a raspberry tea. Hold on, baby. I'll let you guys know. If I find it. I got Anatella. Oh, this one's good. I see another Now look, hear me out. This is why I don't like to go natural. Who who is coming to pay that? Not me. Not me. Not me. But we're gonna find something and it's not gonna cost that. I'll tell you that much. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Alright guys. So one thing natural grocers does not do is bag your stuff. The dude was on the phone. They didn't even want to give me a box. <sighs> they did not have mel they had melatonin for kids, but not that. So we gotta hurry up and run to Walmart. We are running behind on nap time. As long as they are down by 3.30, we're good. But we did get snacks for our movie day tomorrow. And I got my teas that I needed. And I will tell you why in a minute. We are now at Walmart. In and out. Melatonin. In and out. I just realized I still have my sunglasses on. So. Here we go. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go with these kids laying down. This is the one that I always get because it has 120. So this is the one that I usually get. I have this one on sale for $6. The Sleep and Beauty. Melatonin, Biotin, Vitamin E. I don't know about that, but okay. Alright. I still need a probiotic. But... They will be all right for now. So, like I said, melatonin in and out. Alright, you guys. In and out, like I said. Um, Walmart Plus Scan and Go really be coming in handy every single time. It is 3:09. We weren't even in there for 10 minutes. So, these. 
right now so when we go home they can go right to sleep i have have been trying y'all i've been trying to not give them these but at nap time i just can't at least at bedtime they'll lay down because dad is home but they really they, they really have like they can try me like i don't have boundaries they gonna learn all right see y'all when we get back to the house all right you guys we've been back home for a little bit but i've been on the phone with my sister was i want i want to show y'all something look so the boys took this water out when they got home it is still ice cold you can tell and then I was like, you know what? I just got off the phone with my sister for a second. And I was like, you know what? Let me go mess with my babies. Then I remembered I gave the number to my mom. Ow. Oh, I need to open the blinds in there. My little plant is getting set. Out like freaking lights. Look at Bryson. <laughs> Bryson's on the bottom. Right there. Ethan's on the top. Out like some freaking lights. I love that for me. Love that for me. That is a dead leaf from here. I just saw it. This just keep pulling it. But yeah, so I'm about to sit down and finish it. I'm almost 100% done editing today's video. So I'm about to sit down and finish that up. No, I'll go back to sleep. Optimus in their sleep too. But alright, y'all. Do it every time. Hey guys, so we ended up getting I ended up getting the vlog that I needed to get edited and uploaded. It's uploading now. It should be up within the next hour or so. We are at soccer practice slash soccer game. So Ethan has a game. The two littles have practice. So here's Ethan right here. There's Ethan right there. <laughs> so Ethan's warming up. Brian's on his way. He got a ride from work, and then my mom's on her way. But I am exhausted. I have all this migraine that keeps coming and going. I took some Excedrin before we came because I really do want to be able to just enjoy their game. So uh, yeah, I'll show you guys, you know, highlights of the game or whatever, like I always do. Except. So when I vlogged Bryson and King's game, I was not recording with every single goal that they made, so that was a bummer. I hope that don't happen again today, but yeah, we're going to watch. Go get it, Ethan. You're doing great, baby. We are back for soccer. Time to go ahead and cook dinner. I really hope it doesn't take too long just because, um, yeah, I just hope it doesn't take too long. I was going to make homemade fries, but I don't have the time. It's already 7 30 because I forgot to buy the uh, sliders. I forgot to buy the slider buns earlier, so just going to go ahead and. First thing I should have done was start the oven, but it won't take that long to preheat. Also, got to wipe down and preheat the griddle too. So. But anyways, I'm about to cook dinner, making sliders and French fries. I meant to buy like tomato, onion, lettuce, and all them things, but it looks like we're literally just going to have cheeseburgers like that. We're going to have to do shredded cheese, so 
it is what it is. It is what it is. We have mustard, ketchup, mayonnaise, pickles. Kind of mad all my onions were bad. Yeah, I'm gonna cook dinner, y'all, and then I'll show y'all how it comes out, and then I'll see y'all later. I'm gonna watch some YouTube. Good morning, you guys. I'm sorry I forgot to show you guys dinner last night. It just, it was here, and it was gone, and I was ready to go to bed. I was so tired yesterday. Um, I'm drinking my little protein coffee, because breakfast and coffee in one. However, it's already 11.30, and I'm already starving. I think I'm going to eat a Hot Pocket. Yeah, I think I'm going to eat a Hot Pocket. So I'm about to heat up this Hot Pocket. Last time, I heated up these Hot Pockets for the boys. You can wait put this box in the trash. I heated up these Hot Pockets for the boys. We've literally all had one at this point. Brian's had one. Each of the boys have had one and I've had one. So I think when I grocery shop this next week, I'm going to buy like the same club size box. So I'm kind of getting over my little Totina's pizza. I'm kind of getting over that, so I won't buy those and I'll buy the hot pockets this time. But yeah, so I'm like super hungry, so I'm gonna eat this probably with some chips. Um, until my morning's going. King does have speech therapy at 12, so he's getting up and getting dressed right now. Um, the house is clean, and then after his speech therapy, me and the boys are gonna have our movie day. I did forget to show y'all what I got at Nature's Groceries. So let me go ahead and show y'all this. Because after I finish my coffee, I'm going to make me an iced tea. But let me show y'all this. So this was everything I got. This is for our movie day. So we got the popcorn. So we got the popcorn, the no cheese cheese popcorn. I love a good cheese popcorn. We got some um, organic graham cracker sandwiches. This is the s'mores flavor and then oh these are mine but i got dandelion root this is really good for detoxing the body but also good for inflammation so this is going to be in my tea today uh, and then our last snack that we got was these made good crispy squares. We got the strawberry flavor, so it's like Rice Krispies with strawberries in it, but healthy, I guess. And then the last thing, now that I'm seeing how much we got, why is everything so expensive? Anything, anyways. And then we got raspberry leaf tea. If you know, you know, you know, you know. <laughs> so this is not only good for um, Pregnancy, preparing your body for pregnancy, but it also helps with cramps and like it says on here, your menstrual cycle and just your reproductive system. Um, but men can also have this too. I am going to buy Brian a different one that doesn't say anything about women's health because I know he won't drink it. But yeah. And all of that was $20. Yay! Inflation. Love that for me. Baby, will you go hang out by the door? Yeah, so yeah, it was twenty one seventy seven, and that was with no tax because in Texas, you do not play, you do not pay a food tax. So yeah, I'm gonna keep it in my hot pocket. Get me some dust, and I'm gonna give him something for breakfast real quick. Probably make him like a peanut butter. The real reason I came into the kitchen was not because I was hungry, but because I needed to take out the meat for dinner. Let's see what I'm gonna buy first. I think I bought the bottom one first. Oh, hold on, I need to get these chicken breasts out. I am going to let these defrost in the sink for a bit, but then once they're no longer like frozen frozen I'm going to put them in smaller individual bags and then put them in a bowl of water because we do have to use our sink throughout the day. As much as I love my sink, it's not divided. So I'm thinking baked barbecue chicken with mac and cheese and broccoli. I think that sounds delicious because we just had mashed potatoes the other day, so I don't want mashed potatoes. And we do have 
still don't have heavy cream, and I'm not going grocery shopping until Wednesday. So there's been a lot of things that I've been craving to cook for dinner, but I'm trying to not like grocery shop, grocery shop, grocery shop. Um, I, it was my fault that I bought sliders to plan to make sliders, but did not buy the buns. So yeah, so I'm gonna make my hot pocket, sit down, eat. I've already done everything that I needed to do this morning. This, it's a chill day. It's a chill day. And I'm going to go ahead and get on the computer and edit. I also need to edit a few TikToks and get those up. So I'll see you guys later when we start like our movie day. Alright you guys. So King just finished his speech therapy. I am warming up their lunch now. And I am finishing up my Hot Pocket. And so as their lunch is being made and they're cleaning up their room. Because we will not have a movie day if that room's not clean. So while I'm heating up their lunch, they're cleaning. And then... I will also be getting our little snacks ready. So, all right. So we're just waiting on them to finish lunch, and then we'll have our movie day. They could not wait. <laughs> How about we get some bottles of water too, guys? Right. King, you can't come until you finish eating. But don't worry, I'm not gonna start the movie until you finish. So I'm gonna find something to rent, hopefully. All right, y'all, this is the hardest part about being a mom. Um, I found, or boy mom, I should say. So I found this video. It's, I guess it's about, uh, or movie. It's Thunderstruck. It has Kevin Durant. It's about an hour and a half long. So that is actually what we are going to watch. And I'm completely fine with that. We're going to watch it, eat some snacks, and then so I think like towards the end of the movie I'm going to give them their melatonin and then let them lay down and I think I'm going to lay down I still haven't edited but that's okay um, Brian works this Saturday so we don't have any big plans and I don't think there's any games so maybe I'll just edit Saturday and get something up for Saturday but yeah I'm resting right now alright you guys we just finished our movie I just cleaned up for the most part from movie I'm about to start the D-Box because there's like some popcorn and stuff on the floor um, but for the most part, everything is still in pretty good order to where I like it. Really do just got to start the debop. Um, those will go with me to my room here in a second. Let's go put this in the kitchen. Just laid the boys down. However, they always act like they don't want a nap. And then it, they get a nap. Or they lay down and they pass out. So that is what they are doing. I did close the curtains because it got hot in here. Like, I don't know, like it's humid, and I'm not sure if it's because like it's humid outside and we weren't. I had the AC kind of high. I had it on 74. So it was pretty warm. But um, my battery's about to die. So I myself am going to lay down in my room and take a nap. Or at least rest for the most part. I need to turn this TV off. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Probably around dinner time. So I'll see y'all later. All right, you guys. Time for dinner. Let's turn the oven on and get to cooking. I have so many different cravings right now, and none of them are for what I took out to cook for dinner. But that don't matter. I already took the meat out. So so we're gonna get to cooking. I'll show you. I for real. Remember to show you guys what I cooked for dinner today. So I'm gonna get to it. All right, you guys. I did decide just to go ahead and show you guys what I was doing. So right now I'm just gonna drizzle the chicken legs with some extra virgin olive oil, and I do mean like just lightly drizzle. I actually need to buy oil for sure this coming week when I grocery shop. We're gonna spread it around on all the chicken legs, and this is literally just to get the seasonings to stick because nobody likes bland chicken so i am going to have to use my hands in a minute because we are going to um pick up the skin and put the seasonings under the skin but the seasonings i am using are this chicken fajita seasoning black pepper garlic powder um, Kinder's wood fired, wood fired garlic, onion powder, and salt. 
Do I want to add some ranch seasoning? I think I do. And then Kinder's ranch seasoning. So I'm going to go ahead and season these up. We're going to do the oil to both sides. So, yeah. So I'm going to add the seasonings. Anyways, let me go ahead and season this one side. So we're going to, I love to start out with um, my seasonings that would easily fall off. So chunky seasonings like this chicken fajita mix and then like this salt because it's pink Himalayan salt and then pepper and then we'll go in with like more of the powders so garlic powder wood fire garlic this one just smells like barbecue like i love the way the wood fire garlic smells um, onion powder remember it ain't seasoned until you're sneezing if you can't see the seasoning add more and the cool thing is, is that most of my seasonings that I use are low sodium or don't have any sodium. So the only things that have salt are this and this. That's it. And then we're going to do the same thing to the other side. I'm also going to pick up the skin and massage it in. All right, you guys, we're starting on the broccoli. All I've done so far is drizzle it with oil and mix it up. And so for the broccoli, we're only going to use onion powder, black pepper, salt, and ranch seasoning but the twist is i am going to mix it with a little bit of worcester worcestershire sauce <laughs> so before i add any more seasonings just add some worcestershire i don't know i love worcestershire sauce so see it just make it's a tongue twister it's like it's like those little things that you used to do in elementary school like Sally went to the seashore, some, you know, them little things. That's how I feel, Worcestershire, that, that word is. So yeah, just gonna go ahead and season these. I forgot to start recording for TikTok, so just pretend. And then um, garlic powder. And we do already have the chicken in the oven. I have it on the air fryer mode. It's called quick bake, but Essentially what it is, is air fryer. Um, so, yeah. But I have it on 425. I have it in there for 20 minutes. And then I'll flip it. And depending on how done it is, it'll either go in there for another 20 minutes. It'll either go in there for another 20 minutes or 15 minutes or um, 10 minutes. So we just shall see. I was going to steam the broccoli, but I guess I'll put a little bit of salt. I was going to steam the broccoli, but roasted broccoli just sounded so much better. So it's going to go in there on the same setting, but I'm not going to put it in there. I'm not going to put it in there until we flip our chicken so that way they can finish at the same time. And right now I'm going back and forth between box macaroni and cheese or um, rice. I just feel like macaroni and cheese would be so much better, but I just know TikTok is going to like eat me alive when I show that I'm making box macaroni and cheese. But you know what? I'm doing what works for me and my family. I was going to make some rolls with it, but Brian, probably too much carbs. Brian probably wouldn't eat them, so that's it for now. Also clean as you go so all of this is about to be cleaned up i'll show you guys in just a minute because like i said there's only 10 minutes left on this sd card so we have trash here i am going to wipe down the counter because we messed with chicken even though it's clean and i did it on the towel still can't trust it so yeah, i'm about to clean this up i forgot to show you guys but the timer did go off for the 20 minutes so i just put the broccoli in the oven and then I just put a little barbecue, my little barbecue sauce mixture on the wings. I put it for 15 minutes because they don't look super done, but they don't look super raw. So I don't think they need the full 20 minutes, but I also think that 10 minutes is too little. Um, also, I got my tea over here steeping. Um, I'm actually going to set it in the freezer for a few minutes because I don't want it to melt all of my ice and then I'm just going to add some raspberry syrup and some coconut syrup because my honey has crystallized but I read that like just leave your honey where it gets hot often so obviously the oven 
and it'll break down those crystals again. Just because your honey crystallizes does not mean it's bad. So if you have honey that crystallized, do not throw it away. Warm it up. But don't do it on like in the microwave, like do like a double boiler type of thing, like boil some water and stick the honey in there or just leave it on your stove. So I'm just leaving it on my stove. All right, you guys, this is how, ooh, focus. There we go. This is how dinner came out. The boys are already tearing it up. And I'm about to, I'm gonna make my tea real quick. And then I will start eating. Just take a look at yourself. Can't even be your own friend. Cause you're way too stuck in your head. How do you think it's gonna end? Nothing that day. There we go. So my little complete dinner.